welcome back again with another video and I want to talk about a couple of things all right now firstly I was supposed to be flying back to the UK today but uh, unfortunately if you've seen on the news there has been some strikes going on in Athens which means that all flights have been cancelled so I'm unable to get on a plane and come home so I'm stuck in Greece there could be worse places to be stuck but um, you know it's still costing me time and money and time is the most valuable thing to me but um, I am going ahead uh, with making a video today as I did plan to and there's a few reasons why but before we get into the video um, in previous videos we've had an advert to say that you know if you do buy something on Parabolic uh, which is my clothing and merchandise store uh, you could actually get an invite into the telegram group and a lot of people have been asking um, how to get into the telegram group and there's a new way now actually so if you join me on patreon it's very cheap okay six dollars and fifty a month all right it's actually five pounds um, in UK in, in English money uh, great British pounds so um, basically if you join me on patreon you will actually get um, access to the telegram group all right so you get telegram access which is normally invite only patreon only updates and live streams okay so um, yeah get over on patreon there's a link in the description you can still buy something on Powerbolic, but that doesn't get you the invite for telegram at the moment uh, but yeah if you do join on patreon uh, that will take you straight through and you'll be able to click on the telegram invite and join the group and you'll be able to you know ask me questions and get answers and you know all that sort of stuff phone calls for some people all that sort of stuff all right guys so get over onto patreon you can have a read and find out um, what it offers there all right guys link in the description okay now i wanted to talk about another project but uh before we do i know you guys like the buy out update so i'm going to give you a quick update on what i'm seeing in buy out okay now um we did expect or i did expect for it to come down to about one uh, 0.018 cents okay now it has still been heading in the downward direction as you can see here but my target is down here about 1.8 anywhere around that area would potentially be a good buying opportunity for me if it would break down uh, through that level that won't be good but you can see it is bouncing off this level which could be classed as an area of support at the moment so we just put a line there all right so that's a potential support area uh, over there okay but I did say that um, I was looking at a potential Adam and Eve reversal uh, uh, reversal uh, on the inverse side though so you can see uh, if we get my brush you can see that we do have this shape here okay and then it curls around okay which would normally go to the downside if that was well if that was uh, the other way around I would be putting in a buy position expecting it to go up okay also what i can see is i can see a larger one here like that okay big triangle there and then curling around okay so that's two potential scenarios for inverse um, adam and eve reversal okay now that doesn't definitely mean that it's going to play out that way but you know from the naked eye that's what i can see so there is a potential for more downside there it is getting a bounce over here okay so i would like to see it take out the previous highs and then i would expect to see it he head to the upside that would invalidate this pattern that i'm looking at over here okay and um i could say that i was wrong about that but we're looking at probabilities okay i can't give you the answers i can't predict the future all i can do is look at it and uh, make an informed decision based on what i'm seeing in the chart okay so that's buy down like i said more potential downside uh, but it would be nice to see it begin to move back up especially going into the end of this week it would be nice to see it would be nice to see um, a bullish weekend for buy down all right guys okay now what am i looking at now we um we talked previously only very briefly about xfi okay which is x finance all right now why i'm talking about this today is they have a liquidity event for a new token they've got which is X Core. Okay, so if you look on their Twitter page, they've got uh, X Core Uniswap LP event. Okay, and at the time there was about eight hours left. Now there's only actually about four hours and three minutes left. Okay, now I'm not looking to take part in a liquidity event on this occasion. I have taken part in previous ones. Okay, but they're, they're not. They've not been as profitable for, profitable for me as I would like them to be. Now, if we talk about Core C Vault Finance. Core is definitely the king of this space, okay? When it comes to this, um, the non-inflationary uh, tokens, 
these are basically just copies and if we look at the way some of the copies have performed in the previous um, you know in the previous days and weeks they've kind of tanked and then they've kind of uh, dumped all right guys so um, that's what I'm expecting with this one potentially if we base it on the performance for XFI now XFI went up about 1400 percent all right there was a lot of hype about it okay and a lot of people are still excited about this project so almost 1500 percent and there's also X swap which is almost like correlated in 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 the price action okay um which is xsp sorry x swap okay and um that also t um, you know went went sky high and uh it's just been you know performing exactly the same obviously it would have went up much higher because this was a lower price token so we got five thousand percent pump there a lot of people would have got rich off that um, if they were smart enough all right guys me i wasn't smart enough to get into that but um yeah, I mean, I heard about this token uh, personally from someone in the group, but Crypto6 is a guy that actually talks about um, XXP uh, and XFI quite a lot. So he's probably your go-to if you want to know, um, you know, more about these tokens. But I'm just literally today talking about the X-Core token, all right? Now, I've got this on standby, okay, um, for purchase. I won't be looking, like I said, I won't be looking to take part in a liquidity event. Why would we look into buy the token very short term, even if it's just a couple of hours to catch that initial pump, and then I will be getting out of this swiftly, all right? Now, you need to make sure that you're not buying a fake token, okay? So you go to the website, take the contract address from here, okay? If you go on Uniswap, there'll probably be probably be several of these, um, like we've seen with previous tokens, like Ankle. Okay, I actually bought a fake um, token by accident. Did manage to get most of my money out, but they actually pulled the liquidity out before I could get the rest of it out. So um, yeah, there's a lot of scams in this space. You have to be extremely careful. I only use this contract address here from the website. Okay, if it's on Everscan, obviously it needs to match up with this. Uh, contract address and you can put that in now you can't buy the token on uniswap as of yet but hopefully by the time the liquidity event is over over here you can uh, purchase um you know um x core on uniswap just make sure you've got the right contract address and you're purchasing the right token i do expect it to pump guys um so i'm definitely gonna be putting something on there and trying to catch that at least now it might be hard to get in at first because of liquidity and stuff like that but obviously we know that from this there's going to be some liquidity in there but you can check on uniswap and find out exactly how much liquidity is in there before you put your position on when it goes live all right guys so yeah that's what i'm looking at at the moment there's not really much else that i can tell you on that until it lands um obviously there's going to be no chart history so i'm not going to be doing you know patterns and, and stuff like that on it you know um we're trying to catch that initial pump, okay? We have to be careful as well, uh, getting in and out. You might not be able to get in and out so easy, despite um, even if there is, um, you know, good liquidity in there, because it's early, all right? So, um, you know, there's different ways that you can get around it. You know, there might be, um, you know, if you don't put any decimal points and stuff like that, if you want to buy 10 tokens, just put 10, all right? Um, it might even be the same with selling and getting out of the token, all right? You might need to get out in little bits and bobs, okay? But if you're in a profit, just make sure you're playing it um, cautiously, all right? Just make sure you've got an, a game plan, you've got an entry and an exit plan on something like this, okay? Three hours and 59 minutes left, okay? So um, hopefully, we'll be able to profit on that, all right, guys? Um, my patrons and uh, people in my telegram group, I'll let people know these things beforehand. Alright guys, so yeah, there's a benefit there if you do join the group. And I'm not trying to extort people, alright guys, you know. I'm not charging, you know, $50 a month for anything like that. This is very cheap, $6.50 a month. Now I'm thinking like, if a lot of people join, you know, it's going to benefit me and it's going to benefit you. Okay, if not a lot of people join, then obviously I'm not, you know, benefiting from that um, that much. But, um, you know, sometimes, you know, do things cheap um, and people respond, you know. It doesn't mean that I'm putting any less of a value on the work that I do. It just means that I'm giving people opportunities to be able to join a growing community, which is very small at the moment, join the community. And, um, you know, we can all bounce off each other. Um, there's, there's there's certain tokens, like, like for example, XFI and XXP. There's somebody in my group that actually, you know, informed the group about that. You know, it wasn't on my radar before that. All right, guys, and after that, I started looking at videos, started looking at, you know, finding out a little bit more about the token. 
notice that Crypto6 was talking a lot about the token and um, yeah, definitely decide to take a look at it. All right, guys, but yeah, look, keep your eyes out for X Core. All right, if, it's, if it performs anything based on what we've seen with these other tokens, all right, then it could be a good one and you could make some money on it. But don't get greedy. All right, guys, take profits. You know, you might go up 100%. 200%, 1000% and take profits and then it might go up another 1000 to 3000%. Don't worry about stuff like that. Take your profits and enjoy them. All right, guys? And uh, don't worry about what could have been. I mean, we're human beings. It definitely does kind of get to you a little bit, but what you can do is you can take, you know, m take some profit out, you know, and then leave some. But the last thing you want to do is be up here and not taking profits. I'm watching it fall all the way down, all the way down, all the way down, all right? Because this is crypto and that's the way it goes. I've seen it happen so many times, guys. People are huddling through the, through the down, the downward, the downtrends, all right? And uh, not realizing any gains, all right? Now these, obviously these tokens could have some long-term potential. I'm not qualified enough to be able to give you a full analysis on this because I haven't looked at it uh, as much. All right, guys, but definitely in the short term, you can make a lot of money on these DeFi tokens, especially these copycats if you play the game right. All right, you don't want to be holding to the floor. Okay, so that's it for now. Subscribe to the channel, like, comment down below. Also, get over onto Twitter and follow me at Crypto Lightsaber. That's C R Y P T. O L Y T S A B E R, and that is actually the same for Patreon. Okay, so same spelling. All right, so yeah, do yourself a favor and get over there, and I'll see you guys in the next video.